we have to write a program to generate a Fibonacci series. A Fibonacci series is nothing but in which we'll have say Fn terms and your Fn will be the nth term and our initial terms will be f of 0 will be equal to 0 followed by f of 1 will be 1 and these are standard. So to find our next value say f of 2 we have to add the previous two terms that is 0 and 1. That can be done by if our next term is f of n then we have to add f of n minus 1 and f of n minus 2 to obtain our f of n. So this will be the formula to find the next term. And this formula can be applied for every values of n which are greater than or equal to 2. So simply to say a Fibonacci series is nothing but over here. If you see my first two values are standard as 0 and 1 and the third value is nothing but sum of the previous two values that is 1 plus 0 is 1 and the next value is the sum of previous two values that is 1 plus 1 2 2 plus 1 3 3 plus 2 5 5 plus 3 8 8 plus 5 gives you 13 13 plus 8 gives you 21 21 plus 13 gives you 34 so this is known as your Fibonacci series so how to find the Fibonacci series using a program? First we have to include our standard libraries followed by our main function. Then we are initializing a Fibonacci with a length of 25 as a type of int and initialize the first and the second element to be 0 and 1 and for every number which is having its value of n to be greater than 2 that is initializing with 2 and less than 10 in this case to make things simple we are writing a for loop and for each values of i which is greater than or equal to 2 we are going to apply the formula as the Fibonacci value of ith term is nothing but the sum of the terms before it that is i minus 1 and i minus 2 so that will be stored in the Fibonacci array which is of type int and then we are printing the values stored in fib array using a for loop. So as simple as that you can generate a Fibonacci series.